Hey everybody, it's Mark again, and there's a lot of people who are inexperienced with Facebook Marketplace, so this video is going to show you how to use Facebook Marketplace. I hope everybody enjoys it. Kick back, relax, grab something to eat, grab something to drink, and hopefully you'll learn something. Now, once on Facebook, and I'm using a computer, so uh, this might not apply to you with a phone. But if you use your phone enough, you'll be able to search. And I can't show you because I'm using my phone to record this video. But over here on the side, you click on Marketplace. Now, whatever I type in... As I was saying, whatever I type in the search area is going to find it. But you want to change your settings. You want to change where you live. Instead of putting 10 miles, you want to go to the maximum of 500 miles in this case. Because we are going to be looking for items that people will ship. Now, if you don't want to um, pay for shipping, then you change however, however many miles you're willing to drive. But because we're going to shipping, I'm going to select 500 miles. And then I'm going to select apply you have to click apply in order for you to change your settings and whatever you type in the search is what it's going to find if you just type cuckoo for example and hoping that people spelt it the way it's spelt and hit enter it's going to bring up everything that the word cuckoo has in it. So here's all the items that are within 500 miles from me that has cuckoo. Okay, but I don't want to be driving 500 miles. So over here where it says delivery method, you click on that and then you put shipping and it's going to show you all the clocks within 500 miles they have the word cuckoo in them to include this rice cooker and warmer which is made by a company called cuckoo it's going to show you everything Here's another rice warmer that's made by Cuckoo that has the word Cuckoo in it. And there's going to be quite a few items because I didn't select a price limit. So let's say you're only willing to spend $50. So in here, the price, you put $50 and hit enter and it's only going to show you everything that has to do with the word cuckoo that is $50 or less to include that rice cooker but you're going to see weights and pendulum you're not going to find that many cuckoo clocks for less than $50 on Marketplace in my area within 500 miles. Here's a, um, a uh, Lux Pendulant cuckoo clock for $30 that they're willing to ship. Some 1,500 gram weights. And that is a good price because 1,500 gram weights, and I'm going to show you, 
1,500 gram weights are 32.50 a piece on time savers. So that's not a bad price. You're getting two for 80 bucks, and the shipping is 16.69. So it's costing you. Sorry, these are 1,280 gram weights. The 1260 gram weights are $24.50 a piece, so $50 plus shipping, and they're asking $39 plus shipping, so $56.69. You're saving a little bit uh, by buying these weights. Another Lux Pendulant Clock. More weights. These are novelty clocks. Looks like it's missing the it's got the key. I don't see a pendulum. But, like I said, you're not going to find, in my area, too many actual cuckoo clocks for $50 or less within 500 miles. Now, but once you reach the 500-mile um, mark, if you keep on scrolling... It'll show you clocks outside that 500 mark range. But again, these clocks, they all say, ship to you, ship to you, ship to you. Okay, but if you change your location, and sorry, I'm going too fast. If I change my location to, let's say... Denver, Colorado. And you could do this. Doesn't mean you, you have to live there. I must have spelled Denver wrong or something. I don't know. There we go. Hit apply. Remember, you have to hit apply. Now it's going to show you everything in this area right here. That's $50 or less. And now we're going to find clocks within 500 miles radius of Denver, Colorado. And you're, a lot of times you're going to see... Some of the same items that you already seen. But if I was to increase my price to $100 max, and you'd be surprised at the difference it will make. You might find clocks for $52.50 or $53 that you wouldn't have normally found unless you increase your price. Hit enter. And now we're starting to see cuckoo clocks. Here's one right here, 5250. I already looked at this clock. This is an antique cuckoo clock. It has a count wheel style movement. And they're asking 5250. And they'll ship it to you. A German clock for $65 and they ship it to you. And so, anyway, if you, depending on your budget, depending on how much you want to spend, but you don't have to stay in the area 
where you live, you can change your location to whatever you want. Um, you would be surprised at different locations. Let's say Florida, for example. I'm going to change my location to Jacksonville, Florida. And uh, again, a lot of times you're going to see the same clocks, but these are all clocks that people are willing to ship. If you increase your price even more, let's say to $150. You'd be surprised at the difference it makes. Here's one for $125. Raven and Grapes theme. There's one for $125. It has a silent lever. That means it's a newer clock. It's just your standard, typical, one-day cuckoo clock. But, again, they're willing to ship it. And just because somebody has $125 on an item doesn't mean they won't take less. I rarely pay what they're asking. I typically say, what is the least that you will take? Because, let's face it, if you want to give me $200 for a clock that I will let go for 100 bucks, I will take the $200. So, uh... I always ask them what the lease that they would take. Here's an after the hunt. It's called an after the hunt because the rabbit is dead and the pheasant is dead. The hunter's been out shooting. It has the topper. It's a musical cuckoo clock. One day. The only issue with this clock is... It doesn't have the horn for the uh, musical instrument, and I don't see any weights or pendulum. But for a hundred and twenty-one, a hundred and twenty-two, twelve, you could have this beautiful after the hunt musical cuckoo clock. But I don't see a picture of the movement. So always ask for a picture of the movement. A lot of times. The clock doesn't have a movement in it. They're selling the case. But with the hands on it. I would say there's a movement in there. It might be a quartz movement. Always ask for pictures. And if they're not willing to give you pictures, walk away from it. And here is a, a clock. It's not a cuckoo clock, but it's made by the cuckoo clock manufacturing company. And remember, we put cuckoo in our search. So everything that says cuckoo is going to come up.
I'm going to do one more location, and then uh, that's it. But I hope here's that same clock, that antique clock for 5250. Let's uh, select someplace out in California. Um, I don't know why Cuba comes up first. San Francisco. Ah, I can't spell. Sacramento. How about I just type in California? Ah. Okay. Give me a second to think. I was trying to spell Sacramento a while ago, and I spelt it wrong. But anyway, here's Sacramento, California. And again, we're within 500 miles of Sacramento, California. So a lot of these same clocks are going to come up. If I take away the uh, shipping, there will be different clocks that come up. But then you're going to have to talk the seller into shipping the clock. And so I just want to show you what happens when I take away the delivery method. I'm going to say all. Oh. So now... These are the clocks that came up in California. It's a nice looking vintage clock. Here's a nice chalet cuckoo clock. Here's a nice cuckoo clock. They're saying it's an eight day. I would have to see the movement for that. It's not an eight day, it's a one day, and you can tell by the weights. The weights are small. It's not an eight day, but it's a, it's what is known as a one day musical Oompa player chalet cuckoo clock for $150. Some movements for $20. That's not a bad price if you get all poor movements. But anyway, this is how I search on Marketplace for items. Whatever, you, if you add the word clock to this search, section here if I put in cuckoo clock your search is going to be different because it's going to show you 
everything that has the word clock in it. It might show you cuckoo at first, but it's going to show you other items because it has the word clock in it. That's a beautiful antique cuckoo clock here for $250. But, anyway, that is how I search for clocks using Marketplace. I hope you enjoyed this video, and may God bless each and every one.